close it was. Well, that last game, we saw it sort of a remake of the second game because picks were very similar, and I personally wanted to play Elise Sin. I was a bit doubtful about it at first because I really wanted to play Elise, but then there was a guy in the audience that kept telling me, big Lee Sin, big Lee Sin. So I kind of went with him, and then it worked out in the end. But the beginning of the game went very well for us. I managed to put some good aggression on the lanes and get some tower dives and kills there. But I did get caught out at certain times where I thought I was stronger than I actually was when I died. But in the end, it was a very close game, especially when we got aced. That's when we thought, oh, okay, we maybe have to take it a step back. But in the end, they messed up in their push middle lane, and we managed to win off that. Uh, were you surprised that they let you have the Zach Lee Sin two times in a row, as that seemed to be the winning recipe? Actually, uh, a lot of teams don't really think Lee Sin is a problem, just because he sort of has a weak scaling, and it's a very skill-oriented champion that it very much depends on how good you are at Lee Sin. Uh, I like to think I'm a bit above average on Lee Sin, but I was more surprised to let us have Zach which I think is just a champion that's just ridiculously broken. Quite strong indeed. Uh, tell me how you bounced back from that first game when they, I'm not going to say wrecked, but they did very well against you guys with that double AP comp. All right, you don't have to sugarcoat it, but uh, in the beginning of the game, I got a first blood, and I was very happy with that, and then we were going to shove middle, but then we had a bit of a miscommunication, in which we ended up giving two kills to Cassidy, and any time that you do that, it's pretty much over. And that snowballed the game from that, but we managed to identify the mistake because before that we were winning that game with the pressure very much. And we simply try to correct that and say, okay, just let me do all the pressure. Uh, me speaking is just me. So just let me play the game and then eventually we can transition into the later stages of the game where everybody can have a play to make and we managed to win off that game two and game three, which surprisingly enough was two blue sides for us, so why not? So this means you're going to be in season four for sure, but of course, I can imagine you just want that big stage once again. Uh, actually, I was thinking a lot more about this game, just about the security. I really don't want to get relegated again from last split. That really was not a fun experience for me. And this just means we get to stay living longer in our pretty much dream jobs. And now we only have going to Worlds to look forward to. And we basically have two shots at going. So if we lose against Cloud9, we can eventually fight against the third place spot again. So we have a really good shot of making it once more and hopefully put in a good showing at Worlds. Finally, tell me about that Cloud9 matchup tomorrow. They've been dominating all split. I mean, of course, going into Cloud9, you're not going to be, nobody's going to be saying Dignitas is going to win this, but I think there is still hope in us. I'm very excited and I play very well with the crowd. And when so much is at stake, completely backed against the wall, that's when I typically play my best. And going into Cloud9, I think that's what's going to happen. But of course, they've been practicing a lot, and their record is 25 and 3. I mean, you really can't compete with that. So I think if we're on top of our game, we can give them a run for their money. But they are going to be the, the toughest match in this tournament. All right, well, thank you very much. Congratulations on a great performance here. And uh, as for us, we're going to send it over to Colby and Freak at the desk for a look back at today's games and forward to tomorrow's action. Well, thank you very much, Shox. And now with day one.